Hi everybody, this is Dakman. Welcome to my first Fallout 4 video. Uh, I know that uh, if you're one of them that follows my channel, you know I'm typically a DCUO player. Uh, but for a little while, I'm going to take a break. And I'm going to do, uh, right now, Fallout 4. Pay no attention to the cute gal who's getting in my camera. Uh, but I'm going to be playing Fallout 4 for a little bit. And I thought I'd do some tips and tricks videos, uh, things like that. So I'm going to start out uh, with uh, this one here. Uh, when you start in Fallout 4, uh, this is Sanctuary Hills. Uh, try not to look too much into the background. I don't want to spoil it for anybody who hasn't played very far into the game. But there are a couple things you really need to do right off the bat. Uh, first of all, you really need to get a source of water. And I do mean pure water. And one of the great things about Sanctuary is that it has a water source. Uh, you just go out to the bridge, look down in the water. Now those big water purifiers there, you will need one in the science perk uh, to be able to build those, uh, but that's just a uh, you know, level away. Uh, if you're like me, I went ahead, a lot of people don't do the intelligence, they go ahead and leave intelligence off uh, and buy the luck perk to try to get leveled up faster and that just I don't really care about that. I'm more interested in playing and enjoying it from the beginning. So uh, you need a six in intelligence and you'll be able to buy the science perk and build those so you can make fresh water. Uh, you can also do, uh, without that, you can do the smaller ones. I just like the bigger ones uh, right now. Uh, <clears throat> and then you will also need, when you start out, a supply of, I don't know if they call this mutt fruit or mute fruit but you'll need those. You'll need potatoes, uh, which I'll show you where you can find those easy, and then corn. And where I go to find those, let me just pull up my pit boy here. All right, you got Sanctuary Hills, and we go down here to Gray Garden. I'll just fast travel to Gray Garden. Now, the reason why we are going to uh, do this is because you will want to make adhesive. Uh, adhesive is a very, very, very important thing. Uh, you do it, almost every mod you make is gonna require some kind of adhesive. Uh, and the easiest way to do it is with these. So basically what I do is I turn Sanctuary into my farm and I farm for this stuff. So you go here and you can easily just take the mute fruits from here. Go inside here, you can get corn and you can get potatoes if you want to get those there. All right, so you can go ahead and get all that stuff. Once you're done, fast travel back. Now, just to kind of show you where Grey Garden is, I'm up here at Sanctuary Hills. Just scroll down till you see the bend in the river and just put your marker just north of that bend and you'll run into Grey Garden and that's where you will, will get those pieces. So then we're gonna run back up here and let me show you a little bit about what goes on. <clears throat> and how you're gonna, of course, make the adhesive. Another thing too about doing the water supply, you'll need the water to make the adhesive, but water is also a huge source of income. I make a ton of caps off of, uh, off of my purified water because it sells so well. So, you got that, you've gotten all your supplies together, go to your cooking station and you're going to craft vegetable starch. As you can see, I've got several purified water in the queue and things like that. But you produce those, and then let me just show you kind of what, what happens there. Let me go over my inventory. I'm going to go to junk and there is vegetable starch and each vegetable starch is worth five adhesive so that is a very easy way if you just get a little farm like that going and of course you can pick up like the corn you can only get a couple of them to start off but you can plant them get somebody to till them turn them over uh, pick them plant the two corn that you get from that and you could just keep growing your farm which is basically what I did right off the bat uh, another thing that you're gonna want it's auto saving. Uh, cutting fluid. 
and I'll show you here cutting fluid you'll get you'll need acid bone uh, purified water which you'll find is is pretty important for several things and steel and that is worth five oil oil is also another uh, big uh, big used uh, commodity in this game so guys that is my tips uh, just for a little bit of a starting off point uh, you can you know you can make a whole lot of money off the water and you can also save yourself a whole lot of money uh, if you can get the adhesive and make it yourself and the oil and make it yourself so guys if you like this video hit the like and subscribe if you have any comments put them in the section below we'll talk to you guys next time